WhatsApp, YouTube and WordPress community. In this tutorial, as you have guessed from the title, we are going to learn how to set up automatic email notifications to your subscribers every time you have a blog post or frequently to let uh, your subscribers know about the popular blog posts on your website, on your blog. So we are going to do that using a tool called Noptin. And the first thing that I would like to mention is that we are going to do it for free, completely. So first, let's learn what are the types of messages that you can send to your users. So the first type is sending an automatic message to your WordPress or WooCommerce users and newsletter subscribers right when you publish a new content. So whenever you have a fresh content going on in your website, there will be an automatic mail that will uh, let your users know that you have a new content. The second type is setting up daily, weekly, monthly, or you can custom the time period. So you are going to send like frequent messages and for a certain time period that fits your needs, which will let your subscribers and users know about the popular content or the content that they might be missing out. How can this help you with your website and your blog? So sending newsletters to your customers, to your subscribers or readers, uh, letting them know about the fresh content or the popular content will help you increase your website traffic. So this is the most important part, is gaining traffic and awareness from your users. So during this tutorial, we are going to learn three main things which I have mentioned. So the first one is we will learn how to automatically send new post notifications to your users and subscribers. The second part will be we will learn how to send daily, weekly, monthly uh, notifications to your users about your content. And the third one will be how to let your subscribers decide what type of notifications they want to receive so that in any case you will not like annoy them and make them just unsubscribe from your newsletter. So I will leave time steps so that you can skip to your uh, favorite part. However, I would recommend you watch the video till the end as it will be very quick and easy. So without wasting your time, let's dive right in. So to start actual creating process, you have to make sure that you have installed the latest version of Noptin, which I have mentioned, the tool that we are using today on your WordPress website. Uh, for that, follow the steps along that I'm taking you right now. So I would like to mention throughout the process that the Noptin is a free and lightweight WordPress newsletter plugin, and it allows you to add newsletter subscription forms to your WordPress website so this is an all-in-one solution tool. You can get to know more in their website. I will leave the links down below. So now that we have our plugin installed and activated, let's dive right into the steps. So before we start, I would also like to mention one more thing. So for more features, make sure to install the ultimate add-on pack, which will allow you to limit new content notification, to specific tags, send new content notifications for product listings and other types of content other than blog posts, notifying WordPress users and WooCommerce customers instead of newsletter messages. So let's bring a quick example. For example, you can set up like several conditions, right? So one condition can be sending product notifications only to your WooCommerce customers and your blog posts only to your newsletter subscribers. Now let's first learn how to create a new post notification email. So for that, you need to open your email campaigns by clicking on the Noptin dashboard and then going to email campaigns link in your WordPress admin dashboard. After, you need to click on the automated emails tab uh, to open the automation page. So the first type is the new post notification, which notifies your subscribers or users every time you publish new content. 
The second type is post digest, which sends your subscribers a daily, weekly or monthly email highlighting your latest content. So for that, you need to click uh, on the setup button for the type of automated email you want and Noptin will then open up a new screen allowing you to configure the automated email. Now let's learn how to edit the latest post notification email. In order to edit it in the email editor, you can edit every part of your notification, including the subject of the notification. Let me do it right now. And then you can also edit the preview text, which is very important. Make sure to write a good copy of preview text so that it will be um, easy to understand and very clickable. And then uh, for the last, we have the main email body where you can um, include the message that you want. You can also add easily add an image to the email body that will appear on the notification for like a specific automation. And then you have to insert the post URL and any text that you want. For example, do not forget to read this content or read this content, not to miss out or um, anything that fits you and your brand. And finally, to set everything up, you need to set the automation status to active and click on save changes. Also, you can always edit this automation by going back to your automations overview page. So you can always click on it and edit any information that you like. Also, please note that in the email, in order to like customize your email, you have to use the uh, Noptin email merge tags in your email subject, body and the preview text as well. So in a short, I will speak about those tags and I will also leave everything down in the description down below in a form of article that will uh, show you everything, all the merge tags that Noptin offers. Now let's learn how to set what post types to include in a post digest mail. So for that, you will be using the uh, merge tag that says post digest uh, right here. I will leave it right here. And it allows you to specify what type of posts to display. You can also specify several posts into one simple merge tag just like following the steps right here. I will also leave everything down in the description so that it is not messy for you and you can easily copy it whenever needed. Uh, by using the merge that I showed you, you can display the latest products and posts in a single section. Also, please note that this section is only relevant if you are using the ultimate add-ons pack. Now, in order to limit the number of posts shown in the post digest mail, you will have to use the uh, merge tag right here. So it says post digest title and you just configure it the uh, number, right? So by default, Noptin displays up to 10 uh, posts in a post digest only and uh, you can set your custom number of posts by using this merge tag. You also have the ability to um, like display all your posts, available posts. For that, you will need to set the number to minus one. You can also limit notifications to certain categories. You can limit notification to certain tags and as I have already mentioned, to certain taxonomies. Now let's learn how to limit recipients of the new post notification emails. For that, you need to, um, if you have the list add-on, you can filter. If you have the list add-on, as I've mentioned that you have to have the ultimate add-on pack, uh, you uh, can filter the recipients of the notification based on which list they belong to. So uh, here we have the filter list, for example, the main list, the new post notifications, and you can create other lists and the same applies to the tags as well. Besides this, you can also set up the sending time. 
You can find the correct settings in the timing meta box. For example, you can display timing uh, after a certain delay and then in the length of the delay you can uh, display the minutes, uh, how many after the publishing you want the post to be sent. Other than that, as I've already mentioned, this post digest can be sent uh, daily, weekly or monthly. For that, you um, can find the actual settings in the save meta box. Here we have the, for example, send this email weekly and then we have the uh, date, um, like the date, concrete date, for example, Saturday, and then we have the time. So once you configure it, everything by your needs, you can click on save and it will be sent weekly in this case and if for some reason you do not want to send this email to subscribers you can still use this to for example send this to uh, your wordpress users uh, for example here we have the recipients sent to we have the wordpress users right here and then we um, select the user role which is uh, in our case subscriber and then we can exclude um, with separated by commas you can ex exclude list of ids of your wordpress users that you do not want to receive this email and you can also send to woocommerce customers by uh, configuring the send to option to woocommerce customers and then you can also decide whether you are going to send these only to your paying customers or to um, like every woocommerce uh, customer and user and you can configure their billing address shipping address um, the option of how many um, times or how many product ids they um, they both and you can uh, separate like the product ID right here for example if you want to send an email to the user that bought t-shirt you have to put the product ID under the t-shirt and stuff like that and also you can uh, send it for um, to users who haven't bought something yet so for example someone bought uh, gloves and they didn't buy the hat but you know that um, like this is a product that is connected to one another after they buy the gloves you can send them the email saying that we have this hat and stuff like that now let's learn how to do the sending process manually for that again you need to go to the campaigns page by clicking on the Noptine dashboard and then clicking on the emails uh, from your WordPress admin dashboard and then uh, you can see that we have here the campaigns and once you hover on the campaign uh, that is under the activated uh, automated emails so go to the automated emails tab first and then once you hover uh, on the campaign you can see here that we have the send uh, now button once you click on uh, send now button your campaign will be automatically sent so this was it for our today's tutorial i really hope you enjoyed it as much as i did because it was very easy to work with this plugin and this tool so uh, in order to learn more do not forget to subscribe to our channel also you can check the description part to go to a very insightful article that um, opens up all the information that I gave you so that you can go through all the parts that maybe were not very clear to you and also you can uh, get to know the merch tags uh, by following the article and uh, this was it do not forget to subscribe leave a like comment hit your notification bell and see you soon bye